I'll open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. Okay. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Okay then. Hey everybody, Vin Wolf here. Welcome back to uh, FNAF Sister Location. I am still having issues. I tried so hard to get this done already, but I, I, my attempts have been frustrated time and time again. And probably goes without saying I've been feeling epically. But I've learned a few new tricks, and I'm praying to God that I can actually pull them off this time. One thing I discovered is I don't have to separately click each of the spring locks. All I re oh gosh, that gave me a fright. All I have to do is um, actually hold the click or hold the mouse, and they wind themselves instantly. Also, oh, it keeps giving me chills. But the little guys crawling in through the middle there. Not on the sides, but it's actually hard to see because I got so many, I got way too much lighting, to be honest, to play this right now. Heck, maybe that's part of the reason why I've been failing as hard as I have. But the little guys coming up the middle, they actually don't do anything. Also, I thought there would be like a separate jump scare for um, if I missed a spring, if a spring lock came undone. No, come to find out, it's still the little mass marionette guys that are crawling through. And I have a totally separate theory for those guys all on their own. But, um... I feel like... I think, and I think, because these animatronics are being rented out to different people for parties, right? So my working theory is that, um... If you rent out an animatronic... Oh, I wasn't ready. Oh, and this again. Uh, dang it. I've actually figured out the trick for this one, too. I figured it out on, off camera. You actually have to, um, avoid certain cupcakes. Like, you know, I'm just gonna shut up and do this because this actually does take some doing. No, no, no! Frack. And I done goofed. It's a big fat pain in the butt, but it is a separate ending in and of itself, which is awesome because, like, I feel like it's Scott's way of saying, like, just because you fail doesn't mean you're a total screw-up. Here's another chance to redeem yourself, and then when you screw up, you feel even worse, and I'm going to turn down the lights real quick. Anyway, like I was saying, these little puppet things crawling up the side there, because... One thing I came to realize was it wasn't actually Baby that was scaring me at... In episode one, when I kept failing as badly as I did, it wasn't Baby that was popping out. It was something different. It was like um, these little Baby-esque things. They were Baby's Babies. <laughs> From uh, the poster in the elevator. So... I have a theory, or an idea, or whatever you want to call it. I'm not a game theorist. So don't quote me, but I think these things are supposed to be like um, little mini animatronics that come with the main package. Like for example, you rent out Baby, you get a bunch of little mini babies. You rent out Freddy, he has his Bonnie puppet, and maybe you get a bunch of little Bonnie Lings or something, I don't know. So these little guys here, my assumption is that they're little guys that come when you rent out Ballora. Or that's my get. That's my guess. That's my assumption. That's my whatever you want to call it. Oh Jesus! Come on. This is a much better checkpoint to have at this point. And yes, you heard me right. Checkpoint. What I'm doing right now is I'm winding them up to a certain position. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah, they got me. They got me.
Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. I just want to punch him in the face. Like, why is this so hard? What? How? Oh, shit. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Ugh, you can play skillet to this right now. Dag nabbit. Alright, come on. Let's go. Let's get her done. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. Well, whose fault is that? You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Honestly, I don't trust you right now, baby. Friggin' had Foxy jump me out of nowhere. You stuffed me in a spring lock suit. And now I'm fighting for my life. I hope I got the other one. I'm assuming it's the same amount of shakes to get both of them off. I guess not. Okay, so this is going to... No, 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 no! Crack it. Give it a try. Give it some vim, which should be easy, because that's the first part of my name. Vin, wolf, hungry like the wolf, motivated like a hungry wolf. This game is bringing unnecessary stress to my life. So I'm clearly missing something when it comes to this game, as far as the, uh, the mini ballerinas, the mini arenas, the mini ballerinas. Uh, do they have a name yet? It's kind of like the music box in um, the second game now. Now that I think about it, I'm making an interesting comparison, I think. I think it's in, in the- I think it's that I think it's interesting me. Shut up, don't judge me. This is already enough stress in my life. Okay, just, you know what, screw it. Doesn't need to be perfect. Let's get to the nine o'clock, nine o'clock. I'm gonna get it. Okay, he's not there. Come on. It doesn't have to be good, just enough, just enough, just enough, just enough. Nope, I'm, I'm, I'm dead, I'm dead. There's no coming back from this right now. It's gonna jump out, it's gonna get me. You watch, once it gets to the... Huh? Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Enjoy some time at home, I will! Give me my crappy soap operas. Give me my popcorn. As the moon rises, so also rises the tension between scorn lovers. Clara is not my baby. Vlad, you suck. Wait, was that a vampire joke? That was so lame, Clara. Like I haven't heard that a million times. Oh, okay, geez. well, how's this? I'm taking the car. The joke's on you. It's a rental. Oh, it's Well, the geez. joke's on you. I set the thermostat to 90 before I left. Oh, what a punishment. Good, I like it warm. Good, because I also set the house on fire. How will it all end? Oh, Jesus. The passion, the tension, the intrigue. Can I eat all the popcorn? Tune in tomorrow for the exciting conclusion. Exciting conclusion? Oh, I can't eat popcorn. Okay. Daddy isn't watching. Huh? Welcome back to your last day on the job. Okay. That Wait. is the last day of your first week. Okay. Some of the most valued qualities that we like to see in new employees are determination, fearlessness, and a genuine disregard for instinctive self-preservation. You've earned Wait, your one-week bonus, which will be given to you in the form of a delightful gift basket, the cost of which will be taken out of your next paycheck. Oh, come now! We've gift baskets containing fruit, nuts, flowers, and of course, the ever-popular cash basket. Using the keypad below, please enter the first few letters of the gift basket you would like to receive. Oh, oh, that's an obvious one. Uh, C... It seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for selecting Exotic Butters. What? 
please be aware that there are still two technicians on site today. Try to avoid interfering with their work if possible. Also, feel free to ask them why they are still there and encourage them to go home. Oh my gosh, they never made it out. Oh. This is all kinds of bad. I am not a fan of this. Oh no. It wasn't frightening, it was embarrassing. Motion trigger, entryway vent. Okay, yeah, that'd be me. But, um, oh, it was... It's a thorn in my side that is gone. On the one hand, thank God, because now I can continue with the game. Let's check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage. On the flip side of that coin, though, crap, because now there's all kinds of new spoopy jump scares waiting for me. Okay. Great. Now let's check on Funtime Foxy. Oh. Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Funtime Auditorium. Your task today will involve more maintenance work. Circus Baby had a rough day and is in need of repair. You will be required to reach the parts and service room by once again sneaking through Funtime Auditorium. As always, please proceed Heck with caution. No! Well, I think we found the two technicians. <sighs> oh. Oh, jeez. Funtime Auditorium maintenance vent opened. Foxy? Is Foxy not there? Where did Foxy go? What is going on? Wait, why am I heading back here? Isn't this where the other guy... Parts and service. Hey! Great job baby. reaching parts and service. Circus Baby has been deactivated for an unknown reason. It's uh, your job to make sure she is structurally stable and secured to the conveyor. Uh, Our technicians will take it from there. I don't trust this. Hello? Can you hear me? Baby? I'm pretending. Remember how I said I could pretend? Yeah? The cameras are watching. Right after you stuck I me in a suit? I must be careful not to move. Something bad happened yesterday. Something bad always happens. Yeah, you hug two people. I don't want people. it to happen again. There is something bad inside of me. I'm broken. I can't be fixed. I'm oh, going to be taken that. to the scooping room soon. Oh no. But it's not going to fix what's wrong with me. What is bad is always left behind. Wait, Will you bad? help me? I want you to save what is good so the rest can be destroyed and never recovered. What's good but and what's bad? Be careful. Ballora is here, in the room with us. Ballora will not return to her stage. Ballora Didn't she get will scooped? not return to her body. You must be careful. You must remain calm and listen to my voice. Oh, I'm going to remain there calm after everything that happened machine. yesterday. You must find it and press it. Oh, wait. Uh... Oh, shoot, what did she say? I'm guessing there's a button. Hang on. Sorry, I had to reload the game so I could hear what Baby was saying, but I just realized, wasn't there a mask up here with a nose that I could click? Oh, there it is. Okay. I could have sworn there was like a pup, like a clown mask or something right here. Wasn't there? There is a button on my cheek. You must find it and press it. 
Okay, so she said there is a button on her cheek, but I don't see no stinking. It's right there. Oh, how did I miss that? Oh my gosh, that gives me the chills. And not in the good way. How stupid must I be not to find this thing? I can see the coils in the background too, and it, it, it's doing nothing for my anxiety. Maybe it's not actually on the cheek. After randomly clicking for an hour, Wait a minute. There is a passcode that you must enter before you can retrieve me. You may laugh at my incompetence. Enter the code carefully. Three. Three. Five. Seven. <coughs> well, screw you too, Ballora. <coughs> oh my gosh, was that Ballora? I know I, I, I said screw you too, Ballora, but... Oh. Gosh. Oh, that was horrifying. Maintenance vent opened. I'll be right back, everybody. And we're back and unsettled. There is a passcode that you must enter before you can You're not scared, but we're definitely me. spooked. Enter the code carefully. Five. Oh. Oh, I'm on a time limit. Something bad happened yesterday. Yes, we know. Oh, screw you, Ballora. There is a passcode that you must enter before you can I've got no nice me. things to say. Enter the code carefully. Just give me an easy one, please. Nine. Two. Five. Eight. Eight. Two. One. Five. Good. Oh, thank God. The hatch should have opened. Take the card that you find inside. Wait. What should have opened? Now you must okay. turn back. I will guide you through Funtime Auditorium so you can reach the scooping room. When you are there, I want you to destroy this body. Put the card into your handheld device, and I can continue to speak to you. Now, press the green button to your left. This will send me to the scooping room. See you there, baby. Huh, I guess the, uh, I guess the curve. Whoa, whoa, rewind, remix. Where did the Laura go? Where did the moving wires go? You must follow my instructions in Funtime Auditorium. Oh, jeez, Holmes. The Laura is going to follow you. She will try to catch you. I will help you avoid her. She will not follow you inside the scooping room. She is afraid. She should be. Go back now. You don't have to tell me twice. Okay. Go forward. Stop. Go forward 
10 left. Okay. How do I know if I'm going left? Oh, oh, I will get it this time. Dang nabbit. Okay, I think I know the trick this time. At least. I think I get the idea now. See, I was just going straight before. I gotta get on this platform and jump. Oh, make that. Okay. Try it anyway. Dang it. Yep, and then I would circle back. that my idea okay then I'm on the right track at least oh I do not auditorium maintenance vent opened here we go again stop go forward and left. I really hope I'm going left. Keep going. What? Oh, it's so wet. Why'd I stop? Keep going. You know what? Massive amounts of forget this. I'm calling it a day. What the heck? I don't understand what I'm supposed to do there. I'm... Am I turning left the wrong way or something? Because I'm using my mouse and I'm sliding it to the left to get where I'm supposed to be going. I mean, if I'm wrong, please comment. I'm going to have to come back to this another time because I have no more patience for this game. Anyway, that's all for Sister Location. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has become a royal pain in the side. Um, there are other games I wanna play. I'd love to get this done, but there's a lot of things still up in the air, and I just wanna see what the ending is, to be honest, at this point. And yeah, I could go check out you know, another gamer's channel, but, but honestly, it would be, I don't know, it's, it would be more fun to experience this with you guys, so. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in another video, but until then, stay blessed, everybody.